everybody's buying into. If you do your job, we'll be good. Um, obviously, it was a different quarterback, but it's the same. It's the same mentality and mindset. So just do my job and get open. What do you think of the playlist today for practice? <laughs> Man, Odie's is always always good. Always a good vibe. You know who picked that or? Uh, I don't. No, I don't know. I don't. What did you see on tape when you look back and watch the film? Um, I think I think second half we really got it going, just clicking. Um, we just got to be more mentally focused going in there uh, this week or in every game, obviously, but just more mentally focused the first half. We were just kind of out of sync, but I think once if we play like this, we did the second half, we would be pretty good. Seven receptions for you last year, seven in two weeks this year. You kind of stepped, especially last game, in the number two receiver role. Was that something you expected coming into this year, or is that just kind of how it's evolved? Uh, just kind of how it evolved, you know. Just me, me personally, I just take it day by day. Um, I don't look forward. I mean, I look forward to the game, but I don't think ahead to the game. Just what I got to do now at practice, make my plays at practice, and I know everything will turn over into the game. Do you feel fully back? I mean, you missed a lot of time. Like, was there any rust that first week you came back? Um, no, I feel I feel good. I mean, as long as my body feel good, then I'm, I'm gonna feel good. Um, just just me, just getting in sync with the with the with the quarterback, the uh, the receiver. So that was the only thing of me coming back, just getting in sync, getting getting in tune with the plays. But I felt pretty good. When you that run play that you credited for a touchdown, was that put in just for that game, or has that been part of the package? For the um. It was kind of a game plan for uh, for man, so a man beater. Um, we obviously we don't see a lot of man, so when we did, when they did see it, they called it and it worked. But yeah, it, it's it's for, for man. Yeah. Is that designed specifically for you though? Uh, no, I think I, I think everybody can run it. So yes, sir. Did your performance against Stanford kind of affect how you played last week? Uh. Most definitely. I feel like my, myself, I'm hard on myself, so I had to drop that game. And I just, the, the whole practice, I was just telling myself, uh, make every opportunity I can, whether it's a short pass, a deep pass, uh, kickoff return, punt return, whatever I can, whatever opportunity I can, I'm trying to make a play. So that's my mentality moving forward and just keep having that mindset every day. You know, it's a, it's a challenge to have that mindset when your body's hurt or when you're tired. But just having that mindset, I know uh, it's, it's going to take me to the top and the team as well. How did it feel having a big game last week? It felt great. You know, um, I don't like to dwell on dwell on, on a big game because I know it's like now now we got another team. And, another, and So just coming in day by day, just trying to make plays every day and, and just elevate. Obviously, Drake a little banged up. I mean, we don't know what that means for Saturday, but do you feel like the receivers have talked about maybe stepping up in case, you know? Uh, yeah, I, I think that's, that's, that's always the, the plan uh, each week, even if he plays or if he doesn't play. I mean, the goal is for every receiver to elevate. Um, whether if, you, if we get one play, two plays, like I said, uh, my role, whatever whatever it is in the offense, I'm going to make the best of my plays, and, and when I get the opportunity to do it, that's what I'm going to do. Is there any little like nuance things that Jackson did a little differently than you did? In the um, I think he's just a little more mobile, um, so that makes it harder on the defense. To, um, obviously, just to buy time with us, but they're two great quarterbacks. Um, they both throw the ball tremendously well, even Miller. So oh, every quarterback here is going to get the job done. If London wasn't able to go, would you feel the responsibility to step up vocally just as a leader out there, just being one of the? Uh, if if he does or if he doesn't, I think I think that's my job. Uh, me, um, I I made that a go to myself just to be more vocal and uh, get get the guys going, even on the field or off the field. If I'm on the sideline, let's go, guys, let's go, let's make a play. And then when I'm on the field, obviously I want to play through play through my through what I do on the field. But obviously what I say, just come on, let's go, let's go, let's motivate the go motivate the guys. I know you said you wanted to bring energy, like you said when you got back. Did you feel a different energy with you know Dante Williams and yeah, yeah, side yeah, line? most definitely. Dante bring brings a different vibe and energy. A mindset, just my mind focus, focus, focus. One and zero in a day, one and zero in everything. Not just one and zero in a week, one and zero in a day, one and zero in everything we do. So just having that mentality, I mean, it's gonna elevate everybody. Do you feel practices are more difficult? He uh, said that he wanted to make that. Important. Yeah, most definitely. So Tuesday, Wednesday practices are more more difficult, uh, more running. Uh, today was kind of hot on us. So I mean, just trying to go out there and, and have tempo, have tempo.